What's up everyone? Hope you are having a great day. So I just wanted to show you a, a new data sharing screen that I've seen in the latest release of Tesla's uh, software. So we are on software 2023.20.7 and this is the first time that I'm actually seeing uh, this data sharing screen. I know that you could opt in to sharing data from the cabinet from the interior cam uh, camera but I'm noticing now that they allow you to uh, report on some additional analytics for autopilot and improvements and then you can also include the start and end dates for the drive you can also include data when the car is parked and then of course we can see this allow camera camera analytics I've never seen the road segment data analytics or charging analytics before. Maybe it was something that they were collecting, but they just didn't really separate it out into its own respective uh, segments. Either way, I've selected yes on all of these. Um, if you've seen some of my previous, previous videos, you know that um, I'm not real happy with autopilot and traffic aware cruise control. Ever since Tesla turned off the radar, uh, it does a lot more phantom braking events. I'm out here in Arizona and on a straight drive going into Surprise, Arizona, I get at least five or six random, you know, phantom braking events on a perfectly clear day here in Arizona. And I think I've also talked about that I think the reason why this happens is it's getting confused with shadows that can sometimes be casted by the little brush on the side of the roadway. But then also sometimes it has the... Uh, the mirage like effects off in the distance and I think the car might be thinking it's either a solid object or it might be thinking that it's water uh, either way it causes a lot of phantom braking events so if I can turn on some analytics so that Tesla can uh, finally get their shit together even better uh, let me know what your guys thoughts on uh, autopilot and the current state of you know Tesla's full self driving software it sounds to me like the full self driving software is better at the moment than you know uh, autopilot and traffic aware cruise control uh, either way thanks for watching my video see ya